Hello guys, welcome to my YouTube channel where we talk about gardening and just other things, you know? So these are okra, but I kind of got the seeds confused, so they might just be cucumbers, but these are about a week and a half old, and they're already growing. These are um, dead, so you might as well just forget about these. And here we got the other one. This is a week old, but it's not doing as well as the other one, which is weird because this one kind of came up first. Well, I planted this one first, and I planted those, like, second. And this is the cantaloupe. This is also a cantaloupe. And these are supposed to be a pumpkin, but they're not really growing. I don't, I don't really see the pumpkin. And this is a okra, which could be a cucumber, but we won't really know until it starts really like growing. And this is my garden bed that I actually made. I actually, this actually took two days to make, so. If you're thinking about making yourself like a garden bed like this, you better consider like like taking actually like thinking about it because it took two days and I was and it's really hot out here to be doing all of this for this little two square thing. And I actually wanted to put some more bricks around it, but I can't because we don't really have a lot of bricks and when we do get some more bricks it's gonna look perfect it's gonna look amazing and this these are okra okras sorry coming a kind of in the way but these are okras just like those over there are cucumbers and I grew I put two seeds in each little air pocket thing but only two or well, three came up but this one's dead so let's not worry about that and I believe I put some carrots right here. And that, you can already see like one is actually kind of coming up. Like this, this right here is kind of coming up. But this is kind of like a dead zone. Like these ones I planted, they don't, they're not really coming up except for like the little things that are just sprouting up. Okay, so that's section A. This is section B. This is supposedly the cucumbers. This one actually is really doing really well, better than the other ones. And I believe these are strawberries. Wait, no. No. I kind of forgot. I don't I don't I don't really know. But I think these are the strawberries cuz I kind of just spread them around. Rule number 1, don't do not just put seeds like in in the ground before not like knowing what they are before. And these are probably carrots or strawberries. But I know it's kind of just weird because I don't really know what is what. And you know I know what you're thinking like why why don't you know what is what. Well, I don't know what is what because I actually like took them out, took them out the packet, and what you're supposed to do with seeds is you're supposed to um, you're supposed to um, germinate them. So you're supposed to put them in a little packet and you're supposed to um, just let them in like warm water and sun. So that's what I did, and I did that for um, two days. And the two days were spent doing this, and I was actually rushing when most of them didn't germinate properly. So not a lot of them came up, and not a lot of them are just really doing the best condition. So, and you're supposed to kind of like water them every day, and I came up here, and I watered them every day. Hence why the um, bricks are wet. So I came out here and I watered them an hour ago. I feel bad for the little guy. Look at him. He's just limp. He's just... He's just there. I feel like he's gonna die soon. Oh, well. But my biggest pride are these. Like, they're just so... 
don't know, they're just so big leafed and they're just sucking up all the nutrients. Oh, and one thing about plants that, like, when you have plants, you have to get them some, like, nutrients. I put, I got them some fertilizer, some starter fertilizer, and then I got, and I put, sprinkled some, um, here, let me just show you what I sprinkled. I actually used this, and I bet you're wondering, where do you get something like this? Well, you can actually get it from... Home Depot, but for this brand, I'm not really sure where I got it from because when we moved into this house, um, my mom was trying to start her little garden that's right there, so she used that for this, and I just used this starter stuff for the plants, most of them, because you only need a little bit of a sprinkle, like, like a dab of salt, like how much a dab of salt would be on food, like that's all you need. Because if you put more than a dab of salt, the plants could really die from too much nutrients. Ironic, but yes, yeah, so that's what I put over there for those. And over there for those. And to start my um, little garden um, back there and cut, make holes in the ground, I actually used this shovel. Which I'll get to in another day, probably like next year because... I don't really feel like digging another hole. It's going to take another day, and it's going to be really cringy. So I guess I'll do that some other time. I guess that would be only if you well, you guys wanted me to like show you how to actually properly make a garden bed, a fertilized garden bed at that, and try to start your own garden. But, yeah. This... This concludes my video. Basically to summarize everything, this is my garden channel. This is my first video. And if you want to stick along for the ride to see how these little guys do, then I'll be happy to make some more videos to show you. <laughs> and more properly this time because I really don't know what's what. And, and also, Rule number one, space them out because when I'm going to show you guys how to space out your um your, your plants some other day, but right now not today because they're really young and if and I don't really know where the um, roots are. So when they get a little bit bigger, when they start sprouting their their bigger leaf like this one, the little bigger leaf, the third leaf, that's when I'll start um really trying to um space them out, but not right now. They're still young. All right, bye guys. See you next week. Bye.